hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is mufaro mazuzi as you may know in today's video we are doing sunday self-care this is some sunday self-care inspiration it's giving us skin it's a spa day at home as you notice i am using mostly sorbet products and that's not because this video is sponsored by sorbet if you go to clicks at any given time they are always having um three any three sobe products for the price of two and the cheapest one is free yeah so any three sobe products and the cheapest one is free so that's basically a three for two deal and in today's video i'm so excited to try out the hydrating body wash because i've actually never tried that one before so that's the one that is in the orange tube i pour that into my loofah and i lather that so that i can actually like start cleansing my body before i scrub my body i think that just makes more sense to do to do that and this is the sobe body wash with tangerine calendula shea butter and vitamin c and it is hydrating i kid you not this is actually doing what it promises to do it is ultra moisturizing that's what they say it's a hydrating body wash ultra moisturizing with tangerine and vitamin c and shea butter those are really 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 great um ingredients you want to find in your skincare and the smell oh my word it smells so great after the whole spa day my bathroom was actually smelling smelling like an actual spa so after scrubbing my body i obviously rinse my body as you can see i'm rinsing um yeah there you go i don't believe in having a full full bath guys i, don't, I just think it's a waste of water then i don't forget to leave my legs guys i feel like we always abandon our legs so i would stand up in the bathtub and literally start scrubbing my legs let's not be lazy y'all you have to look after your skin your skin is your largest organ if you had if you were not away um and i mean you have to take absolute good care of it because it is the only one you have um yeah so I am making sure not to leave my feet as I scrub my body. Next up is the exciting part, the body scrub. I've never actually used a body scrub in my life before, guys. So this was very exciting. And of course, me being me, I had not yet opened it. <laughs> there I am fighting with it to open it. And then I eventually opened my body scrub. Um, the body scrub was very, very interesting. I expected it to be very harsh and very... Um, I expected it to be very drying. Yes, I expected it to leave my skin dry and just terrible. But because there is shea butter in this body scrub as well, so it's just the same as the body wash. It's also um, tangerine, calendula, shea butter, and vitamin C, hydrating, ultra moisturizing. And I, you actually be able to see once I rinse this that it's going to come off like milk, and that's because there is. It's loaded with shea butter. They were very generous with the shea butter. You can tell that. And my skin was left soft after using this body scrub, which is very, very interesting. I did not expect that. And vitamin C is great for brightening your skin and helping to remove sun damage and helping to remove um, over hyperpigmentation. Um, this was a really, really great. And it smells so, so nice. But I think the body wash smells nicer because with the body scrub, they had to use more shea butter so that it doesn't end up drying your skin. And yeah, I really enjoyed the body scrub, guys. I will actually be using doing this every single Sunday. I will not be missing out. I will not be skipping this routine because it's so, so good. You feel like your skin is breathing nicely. It's soft. It's supple. It's smelling nice for for something which is very very important and then i just rinse that off and i'm pretty sure you notice that it's like coming out off like it's milk and yeah then i don't forget to rinse to scrub my legs as well so now i am also continuing to scrub my legs and making sure not to neglect my feet in between my toes we always neglect feet well i always neglect my feet and they are very ashy so it shows that i always neglect my feet now for the fun part guys skincare pampering so i actually bought this double action vitamin c serum mask 
um at clicks it was around 59 rand and oh yeah i forgot to mention that the sorbet body wash is 75 rand and the body scrub is 75 rand the body wash is a good deal i've mentioned this before on my channel because it is 700 it is 400 mils which is very big and it actually lasts really long however the body scrub does seem like a very small tub it is 250 mils so anyway back to the skin i first cleanse my skin before i use the mask because as per the mask's directions you have to use um you have to use you have to cleanse your skin sorry before you can actually use the mask. So i'm using black african soap or african black soap um to cleanse my skin and i have talked about african black soap i will link the video um in this video where you can see a short review and also a skincare routine a more detailed skincare routine of mine um so yeah um the mask like i mentioned is two steps so it's got step one which is the serum and the serum you're supposed to apply that or rub it into your face for about two to three minutes and um so far i'm just opening it up and you'll see it's a clear serum very very nice i enjoyed this mask guys i'll actually be using this mask again and you can see there's some serum very generous amount of serum just enough and you use that to massage into your face and there you go i am massaging this serum into my face and very very nice um just like any serum really and working that through so as it was drying up or as the time went by the serum started to get dry on my skin which makes sense so that you wear the mask on top of your skin your face after the serum is dried up so i open up the mask and it's folded so i was a bit not sure like which side goes to stick onto the face i'm not sure if you understand my question but to me it made more sense that the side that was closed up should go on the inside of my face I'm not sure if I made the right decision there. Um, and then I didn't put the... It was very cold. You can see I am hesitating because the mask was very cold. But that's normal because the mask is... You know, it's got some serum as well. Um, and this mask is basically got vitamin C again as well. It's got niacinamide. It's got citrus, um, lemon extract. You know, all the things that are good at brightening up. So this is the brightening... The sorbet brightening face mask and um yeah i suffer from hyperpigmentation but surprisingly again i thought this was gonna dry out my skin this mask left my skin so soft so uh, supple and just really nice i was very very happy with this mask so now i'm removing it after 15 minutes i did put wear the mask for 15 minutes i think because of editing it looks like i wore the mask for two seconds but i wore the mask for 15 minutes 15 to 20 minutes actually and you can see it feels like my in my face has got this instant glow i absolutely enjoy this face mask like i said i will definitely be buying this face mask again um absolutely lovely now um the next step i will be doing my moisturizing routine this is the nivea um this is my favorite go-to nivea moisturizer i use it every day it's got spf 15 i am looking into um investing in a good sunscreen because if you do want to fight hyperpigmentation you definitely want a good sunscreen but i will inform you guys once i manage to get a good sunscreen then you have to use roll-on guys you know this is a self-care day we use roll-on every day anyway this is just standard routine um <laughs> now the next step is i'm going to be moisturizing my body that i've scrubbed and everything but honestly this is just to further hydrate your body so i got the sorbet i have a sorbet body butter which i don't use because i have already a moisturizer that i am very much um <laughs> dedicated to so you can tell that i've hardly used this um, body butter but i was just like let me try it on my legs because i'm not a big fan of using scented um body moisturizer so i used it on my legs and you can tell um that i'm now applying it on my legs and 
now i am moisturizing the other leg it's a good body butter i didn't react to it or anything so i once had a bad reaction to a, a very it was a highly scented body lotion but it was back back in the day so i tried to just play it safe like you know i use basically something that is close to an aqueous cream for moisturizing my body because i don't believe in using highly scented products but funny enough soul based products are not heavily scented they smell nice but they're not heavily scented which is good because fragrance is actually really bad for your body is really bad for your skin um because it just it can be too harsh so with the body wash and the the body scrub the I do have a very beautiful scent but it's not overpowering it's not too much because you don't want harsh fragrance on your body so this is the also heavenly um daily is the creamy caress the also heavenly creamy caress i've spoken about this since you know the early days of my channel i love 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 this body moisturizer i use it all year round 24 7 like every day that is my go-to i don't know what i would do if they ever discontinue this product because it's the only body lotion that i use <laughs> so you can tell that is almost like halfway through because it is the only body lotion or body cream that i love to use and that i prefer and i've hardly used the sorbe body butter i should probably gift it to somebody um yeah this is it you guys i hope you enjoyed this sunday self-care day look after yourself your skin is your largest organ and if you check below this video there is a heart written thanks below or inside you can actually gift me a, a 14 rand a 30 rand 75 rand you are not obliged to but i'm just letting you know that you can because it is a new feature that has been introduced in south africa if you want to support my content creation you have able to do so i love you for watching always bye